Okay, you guys are on page 15 in your spiral, if you could get there please. And then write down this objective. I can multiply and divide integers which is slightly different from the objective I've posted on the wall. Our notes are going to be about multiplication and division, but our activity also includes subtraction and addition. Okay, hopefully near you, you can find a pair of scissors. I'm passing out this paper to you that has two of the um, foldables on it. So cut one out and hand one to your neighbor. And then once you have half of the paper, cut the oval out. Because mm -hmm, there's three of you. You need, you need three of them and there's two on each paper. Okay, back tables. Again, I'm recording, so you will hear me talking to you every time we watch this later today, so please keep your voices down. Don't be sorry, we did Okay. You're just cutting the outside edge. Do not cut open the, t the front flap. So it'll just be an oval that looks like this. Sabrina, can you give him his? <coughs> there are markers in your boxes. You can take a couple of minutes to decorate the front symbols for multiplication and division. The color does not matter. You can choose whatever color you want. Nature's purple. And she said any color. Any color. Spend a little time decorating the front cover. Do you actually have to decorate it? No, we don't have to. Once it's decorated, I want you to fold it in half so that it looks like this. Okay, using your markers on the inside, I would like you to make a triangle like this. Labeling the top with a plus sign and the base on both sides with negative signs. Um, do you have to go to the division too? You don't have to know. Colors don't matter. You could even use your pencil on this. Mm -hmm. 
And let's go ahead and take glue and put it into our notebook. Does not take very much glue, just a few dots around the perimeter. And place it underneath the objective. it's glued down when we open it we should be able to see our triangle for integer multiplication and division I'll show you guys how to use this in a moment when everybody's finished with the glue When we use this triangle, <clears throat> it's a visual reminder that when we have multiplying the two negatives, we get a positive. And if you notice when I said I multiplied a negative and a negative, I can cover them, and what's still showing is a positive. But if I multiply or divide a positive times a negative, what symbol is still showing? Negative. So let's put a couple of examples down to show how this works. If we did negative 3 times negative 3, the best way to use this symbol is just to think first about is my answer going to be positive or negative? And so I'm going to cover up a negative and another negative because I'm multiplying negative 3 times negative 3. What's my answer going to be? Positive. 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 And then think about the math fact. What is 3 times 3? And that's how we use these, this little triangle. So oh, just for our notes, you wouldn't normally do this. You'd normally just put one on your paper. But for our notes, let's go ahead and show what happened with it. We covered up a negative, and we covered up another negative. And what was left? Positive. Our positive. And that told us what our answer was going to be. It works as well with division. So if I have negative 64 divided by 8, the question is, what is that going to equal? Is it going to be a positive or a negative is our first question. I'm going to cover up a negative because of the negative 64, a positive because of the positive 8, and what's our answer going to be? And then we do 64 divided by 8, and we get 8. So you're really thinking about two questions. First, is it going to be positive or negative? And second, what is the math I'm actually solving? Does that make sense? Okay. I'm going to give you guys a few minutes to work on this worksheet. There is a typo with questions 11 and 12, so as soon as you get it, just cross 11 and 12 off. also recycling in that blue bin so if you can get your scraps to there and clean up your area. We're done with those rotations all over the time.